we reproduced. <laughs> We've conceived. <laughs> Alpha Tribe, it's Alva. Welcome or welcome back to my safe space. Um, with that being said, I want to remind you guys that I'm sharing a very vulnerable and sensitive journey and transition in my life. Um, I hope that you guys can learn something or relate to it and share your stories with me in the comments below. If you like my videos, please remember to just click the like button. If you like me in general, or my partner, or my story, or my journey, just subscribe to my YouTube channel. It would help out tremendously just by starting there. Um, I just want you guys to know that this is the first trimester only so far and we have four parts in my first trimester so once I get to 100 subscribers which is now I'm gonna go ahead and upload part one then next week part two then part three then part four I'm so upset I'm sorry that I'm talking to you like that but I don't know how else to get through to you you ate a Big Mac today in secret. It wasn't in secret. Yes, it was. I told you no, I you was gonna it. have McDonald's. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Baby, you can't lie about that. I'm not lying. It's just I us two you. on the receipts. I told you. Look at the receipts. No, I that said I was you. about to cry because I needed You're a Big Mac. And what happened? And then I and then you still it. didn't even bring me the milkshake. You have nothing to say. I can't even get a I'm sorry. Baby, I can't even get a I'm sorry, baby. I'll, let's go get you the milkshake. I don't want that anymore today. If you would have brought it surprisingly, it would have hit me. And I would have been like, wow, that's a surprise. But now it's not a surprise, and I know what you did. I know what you did. I don't want it. I want chicken nuggets. Do you want chicken nuggets? From seasoned vegan. You didn't make me throw up, baby. Hey, Alpha Tribe, welcome back to my YouTube channel, or welcome if you're new here. My name is Alva, and this is the Alpha Tribe. This is a safe place. There's only good vibes at the Alpha Tribe, though, so you already know. We are a seasoned vegan, getting some dinner. Well, I already had a Big Mac earlier. Oh my god. Willie's not too happy about that because Big Macs aren't healthy. Big Macs aren't just not healthy. She had it in secret. I didn't. Behind my back. I and, didn't. I told she, him. I, she actually went against our agreement. You have to say it right. He just doesn't like the fact that I didn't bring him the strawberry shake, <laughs> which was part of the agreement. We, but you forgave me. I forget. Just so the camera has the record too. And so. now we're here at Season Vegan getting his favorite food. Oh, I'm also hungry. Because he's throwing a fit. Yeah, you have a beautiful You messed face. with me on purpose too. No, you messed with me on purpose. I, I, but Amazon makes some comfortable ass t-shirts. I used to work there for a year, so I wasn't going to get rid of this amazing t-shirt quality. I literally feel like I'm going to throw up right now. For real? I think I'm just gassy. You want me to get your juice right now? No, I'll wait. Like that's yeah. All right, me and Willie have some news to share with you. I think you my feet stink. That's not your feet. I smell that smell. That smelly smell? I smell the smelly smell. <laughs> that smelly smelly smell is kind of smelly. We reproduced. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't think that's how you say that. We're reproducing. I think is we're conceived. Oh, we have conceived. We have conceived. We have conceived. All right, so we we conceived. <laughs> And this is gonna be our first trimester vlog. You're making my stomach hurt. You're making me have to shit. You're and you can't be blaming it on me because you have to get your bowel system together. William is a Big Mac. She had a Big Mac today. William has the worst pregnancy symptoms ever. She had a Big Mac today. I'm and her stomach was fall. hurting like she was gonna shit herself. The other day she had a a salad with some chicken cutlet fried Stop. in it. Stop! You are ruining and it. To get in the please baby she had a chicken with mad jalapenos in it and i threw up everything but the jalapenos That's, and it wasn't the jalapenos that no made her sick. it wasn't that's the first trimester y'all <laughs> he's so happy what'd you get baby show him he's not good at being a youtuber i don't even know what this is he got a bbq crawfish sandwich um this cookie is the only cookie that they sell though and it's fire Vegan chicken nuggets. These chicken nuggets, so freaking delicious. Like, what I had was burdock root. Oh yeah. Fried okay. burdock root. His crawf, isn't it crawfish? It's imitation. Oh, cause that's not vegan. 
we got that and then we got some cupcakes he got a red velvet cupcake this one and i got a lavender cupcake we have never had the lavender before they said it's new and then we got their juices so i got a little chinola juice cranberry juice uh, I don't want to disrespect because just know that seasoned vegan is the best food you're ever going to eat in your whole life. That's how it feels. Yeah. Usually we get um, like the platters that have like mashed sweet potato, veggies. They have like steamed broccoli and greens. And then the oh, crawfish. macaroni and cheese. Macaroni and cheese. Oof, so delicious. But I wasn't hungry today because of the... Um, so I'm just gonna eat some chicken nuggets because we usually share that anyway. You want your juice? You want, what do you want? Um, okay, so let's talk baby because it's been a minute. Tomorrow, little baby will be seven weeks old. First trimester things. Tomorrow, little baby will be seven weeks old. He will be at, he or she will be as big as a blueberry. We're gonna talk symptoms. What symptoms have you been feeling, baby? Irritated. Mm-hmm. Bloated. Mm-hmm. So, I... I weird sleep. Sleep's been a little weird. But we've also been having really... Headaches. Vivid dreams. Headaches. Oh, those are your symptoms or mine? Because I've had all of those. I thought we were in my symptoms. Oh, yeah. Literally, we've had, we had the same symptoms. Um... My feet hurt. <laughs> But that's my feet kind of hurt. That's just me. Yeah, we're kind of active. Not me though. My feet just be hurting. <laughs> well, on May 28th was the first day of my last period. That means that at around June 11th, I would have ovulated. That's the day we got freaky. We didn't get freaky. We got intimate. We had an intimate moment, <laughs> and we were both very aware of that moment. I would say it was a 10 out of 10. What? We're gonna tell them that? Oh yeah, it was a great time. I'm... What are you talking about? It was nice. It was pretty good. It was a day to remember. And then um, the next time I was supposed to get my period was gonna be on June 25th. So on June 25th, I don't get my period. And we're like, oh, I'm pregnant. <laughs> so the next day we got pregnancy tests at the dollar, the family, the Dollar Tree. We got two pregnancy tests at the Dollar Tree and I took them in the afternoon. They had a very faint line and I was like really nervous. I just remember feeling really nervous. Willie was playing his video games and we were just kind of trying to be nonchalant about it until we got the official news at the doctor. Two they, days later. Two days later. And the doctor, I was like, I need to take a pregnancy test. You're getting too mainstream. Save me four. No. Sorry, but the big man. These are vegan, lady. Ooh, they sound crunchy. That Big Mac has me so full that if I take a bite, I will vomit immediately. So far. Oh, she be mad hungry all the time. I'm hungry all day. And I actually read an article yesterday or the day before that said I'm supposed to eat small, frequent meals, which makes sense because, like, breakfast, lunch, and dinner is not enough. Like, I need to have half my breakfast in the morning the other half at brunch then some lunch then like a snack then dinner and by nighttime i just have to go to sleep because i will dead ass keep eating so i found out when i was three weeks pregnant four weeks pregnant you mean five weeks you just said three weeks i think it was like three weeks yeah it was like the soonest you could find out you're pregnant we found out <clears throat> like i was literally two days late on my period when the doctor told me for sure that i was pregnant so i go into the doctor's office i pee in the cup and then they sent me to the back and i was like i know already the nurse had to take me to a separate room so i was like oh they're about to tell me because any other time God damn. Sorry. God bless. <laughs> any other time that you take a pregnancy test like i've taken pregnancy tests all my life for like birth control and stuff like that i this is my first time ever being pregnant though congratulations yeah, thank you they take your thing and then they be like miss rodriguez you're negative <laughs> and i'll be like Lit, i'm out of here but this time they took me to the back room and then the, the nurse told me like i'm pregnant and i was like oh my god and i like started tearing because i was like holy shit like this is real i was like there there's no going back like there i already knew and you we already spoke about 
us not um, having an abortion or putting our child up for adoption. Like, we already spoke about all of these things. So I was like, it's real. Like, you know, you get pregnancy scared sometimes, and sometimes you have a little I would say accident. we weren't even scared. Yeah, we weren't scared. We were... We were shocked and excited. I was shocked and excited right away. I was just like, for real? Like, I thought I was, you know, getting excited and I was going to be negative. But it was positive. And I was like, all right. So then the, the, you know, they're really sensitive in the doctor's office and they give you options right away. They're like, they don't really know if you want to have an, an abortion or if you want to keep your baby. So they give me a paper with all my resources and I was like, no, like I'm trying to, I'm keeping this baby. Like, give me the prenatals. But the nurse was type weird and she read it wrong. Like, I'm reading it with her and she literally reads it wrong and tells me that I have to start my prenatal vitamins at my eight week prenatal appointment. And I was like, so I left and we went straight to Target and I bought three different brands. Yeah, it was Target. Of prenatal vitamins i stood there for a couple of minutes just reading all the bottles reading the ingredients seeing what they had what was best what was um excuse me i got like one vegetarian one one with a high um rating review and then another one that had like good flavors or something oh and it brought a lot of them so i started taking those right away the day is oh and i got you the mushrooms oh yeah he got me these seven wonders mushroom pills capsules that have like seven really healthy vitamins i'll talk about those later on and i've been taking those every day ever since also it's july 15th right now i ate all the chicken no you didn't so i literally obviously have no stomach yeah i was like let me see yeah i was for sure four weeks for for sure i was four weeks on the dot it was as big as a poppy seed and it was an apple seed it? this whole week has been a s yeah because i don't know what it is i call it a he because it just flows better and maybe as a boy i feel like i feel it but you i, I could literally have triplet girls who knows <laughs> god <Duh>. please <laughs> please don't um so this week has been about the size of a sweet pea and then tomorrow Jesus. which like basically today going into tomorrow it'll develop into the size of a blueberry so when I found out at four weeks, I was like, that kind of makes sense. Cause I was feeling, I was feeling glowy. Like I was feeling energetic mm. and like, yo, he was really hungry. This is how I feel. This is how I feel 24 seven. Like you're living, I'm living mm. through you. How is that baby? Let me see, show them the inside. Mm. You got to put it in focus. You see that? Yeah. Chocolate chip, walnut. All right, so at four weeks, I was like, mm. I was really bloated. So I had a couple of pregnancy symptoms. I was really bloated. I had a little bit of cramping. Um, and then that was about it. At five weeks, I started feeling extremely tired. Like, extremely tired, but oh, not... I not was, tired and sleepy. Yeah, like I felt like weak. Like I just wanted to lay down and take a nap mm. all the time. And then, um, you know, I'm taking my prenatals. I'm drinking a whole lot of water. I was just taking it easy. I started having headaches. So my biggest symptom has been the headaches. Like I've had crazy bad headaches that feels like migraines, which I feel like have to do with my molars and seeing like being on the screen all day at work and at home. Also the heat, like being in hot or humid temperature, like being outside or in our living room, like where there's no air conditioner, I will feel like like if it's hard to breathe like out of breath and uncomfortable so then last week yeah that was like last week at week five this week i felt mostly tired and headaches my bloating mostly went away my bloating went away i'm just a little chubby right now it's like the one of the heaviest weights that i've been in my life is it really i was um the heaviest i ever was was 145 and that was after high school How much i haven't weighed myself in a while you're like I'm like 120, like 130. One, 125. Yeah. Probably like 125, 130. And the headaches are crazy. And I'm tired. But I have no other updates or experiences. But I'm going to let you guys know as the time progresses. Because I'm filming my first trimester, second and third trimester. And then labor and delivery and postpartum. It's going to be a series. 
No, those are gonna be five different videos for YouTube. But what I'm is your you. position in this pregnancy? Oh, my position in this? I'm. I am the father. <laughs> he is I the father. I am the father. All right, we are the parents, <laughs> and we are out of here. Bye. Okay, so we're getting ready to head into part two. Part two of my first trimester. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.